was so Bush League rants. Oh man. You know what was so Bush League earlier? I couldn't get a video to start. Look, the internet isn't easy. Okay. Let me tell you, Sometimes Tara, you mute. This is, if nothing else, testament to uh, us and our art form. Uh, ne e best experienced live in, dare I say, oh. a theater. And you know what? Just at these uh, at this current time, um, you can't do it. You can't do it. Without you can't do it, y'all. Yeah, you I'll, can't I, do it right now. I like all these people. I like all these performers. I like all these uh, all our our audience members, all our fans. Uh, too much to to like. Like f fun is fun, but like not. I don't want to put anyone at risk for fun. And this is a way no. to at least have fun in a way that doesn't put people at risk. So we'll do it this way. We'll do it. Rance, you're muted. Rance, uh, you're, 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 you're muted. Sometimes, sometimes. <laughs> things uh, oh, boy. And you know what else? While we're on that note, I just. Oh, 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 oh. oh there she goes. She got, um, What's up? Things are really uh, falling off the wheels here, everybody. Uh, yeah, the expression is falling off the wheels, I believe. Off the wheel. right. uh, who can say what, uh, what's going it. on? You know, it's, it's just like things are, are getting a little bananas. Uh, technology's hard. Technology is hard. Uh, oh, we my best. God. We try hey, it. on that note, what if we threw it to people that, that are doing something different than, than, than failing at technology like ourselves? I would love to do that. <laughs> hey, I'm going to give a little background. This group you're about to see, RSV Improv, has been performing short form and long form for about three years already. Um, they do uh, they do all kinds of shows, including um, all kinds of different improv forms, as, as many improv nerds out there know. And they're going to be trying one tonight uh, called The Conversation. Uh, I'm going to need lots of suggestions for this form. There's going to be nine players from RSV Improv from Cleveland, Ohio, and they're going to need um, lots of words to inspire them. I actually think I have a lot of words, but keep them coming just because why not? Uh, and as I go through to assign them to them, uh, they'll tell you a little bit about their form when we bring them on here. So let's give them a big round of applause. RSVP Improv. Here we are. Hey, 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 hey. for helping out tonight, RSVP. We're so excited that you uh, you were coming to our in-person festival, and now you're here, obviously world famous on the internet. <laughs> world <laughs> famous. World excited famous. to be here. So I've been getting these suggestions from the audience, and I'm just going to assign them. They all have a number. I'm assigning them a, a one-word suggestion. Do you want to tell the audience about your form a little bit, and then I'll give them those uh, suggestions for you? Absolutely. Um, so uh, we, like the rest of you, uh, have all been quarantined in our houses for what feels like years, uh, and we've had a lot of time to think. Uh, and, you know, we've just been having these idle thoughts, uh, and we thought, you know what, why not share them with the internet? Uh, so what you're about to see tonight uh, is just a smattering of things uh, that, that we've been thinking about. <laughs> I love it. Uh, we've got nine words. Are you ready? We are ready. Cool. Ready. Okay, so number one, your word is witchcraft. Ooh. I, I pick some doozies. I pick some doozies. Number two, <laughs> your word is fission. Fission. Number three, your words are doggy daycare. Doggy daycare. Number four, your <laughs> suggestion is halitosis. Halitosis. These are amazing. P.S. Great job, viewers at home. Number five, your suggestion is cherry cordial. Cherry cordial. Mm-hmm. Number six, your suggestion is Florida. Florida. Number seven, your suggestion is mosh pit. Number mosh eight, pit. Uh, your suggestion is angel food cake. Angel food cake. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. And number nine, your suggestion is flaunt. 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 Okay. You got it. Uh, mm -hmm. Cool, take it away. Thanks, RSVP. Have fun. Thank you, Tara. I'm Jenny, and I have witchcraft. I'm Jennifer, and I have fission. I'm Tracy, and I have doggy daycare. I'm Raul, and I have halitosis. <laughs> that must be me next. I'm Mort, and I have cherry cordial. 
I'm Chris, and I have Florida. I'm Pete, and I have Mosh Pit. I'm Mark, and I have Angel Food Cake. And I'm Marianne, and I have Flaunt. Ladies and gentlemen of the internet, we present Conversation. So, Jenny, like this quarantine, it has me going nuts, and I just losing my mind. Right, and I was just like, I just like have this constant like sense of jitters, right? And like, I'm just so freaking nervous all the time, and I just want to explode. And 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 I actually, <laughs> I can't do anything right, even when I do get out. I wrecked my car yesterday. Oh my God. Yeah, <laughs> but like, this is the first time I've driven since March 14th and I wrecked my car. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, can you believe that? <laughs> what are you gonna do? Well, I mean, thank goodness I have insurance. I mean, at least I can afford that right now. <laughs> my insurance company was nice enough to cover it. <laughs> So, you know. Have, have you ever thought of, of possibly witchcraft? I, I, don't, I don't like to spread it around, but for years I have been practicing witchcraft. Some people might call it raising children, but I call it <laughs> witchcraft. Now, you're in a store. Mm -hmm. and the people that, that make the stores, they put candy, candy, when you're checking out. And you've got three small children. What the hell do you do? And well, well it's a magic spell. You use witchcraft. And oh. you tell them that all of that candy in the checkout is decoration. Oh. Witchcraft, witchcraft, see, it works. <laughs> that, that's that's absolutely brilliant. So so really, what I should have done then when I crashed my car right under the, into like the restaurant, my favorite restaurant. I was so excited that they were open. I crashed my car right into it yesterday. Oh. So so I should have told the owner that it was decoration. I was like fixing the exterior. No, you've got it. Oh. <laughs> I think that maybe this is like my calling like i am going to be the most powerful witch this world has ever seen i'm gonna use this energy and i'm gonna i'm gonna be a witch too it's when amazing you... my children think i am awesome and i really kind of suck but but i'm awesome in their mind jenny 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 have yeah. some more tequila oh tequila thank Absolutely. you this party is fantastic. It reminds me of my days on spring break in Florida. <gasps> Florida. Yes, yes. Good times all. A little bit of an arrest here, a little bit of a beer bong there, but a good time had nevertheless. Chris, Chris, Chris. Jenny. Do tell more. Well, uh, as it happens, we were down with my friends in uh, Florida in uh, spring break 1989, and we went down to... Uh, you know, have a festive time. We were arrested. I was arrested next to one of my friends wearing nothing but his underwear, paraded down to the police station where they took all our beer and charged us $34. What? Now that is criminal. It is criminal. They drank all our beer right in front of us. You should have used a little witchcraft on them. Witchcraft. That would have been helpful. These okay. are not the beers you're looking for. I can see that working. Exactly. Put a little towel over it, chug it behind the towel, poof, it's gone, officer. Which wow. Way? I wish I could use that in my day-to-day -day, uh, habitation. Now that with this social distancing, I can't really go anywhere. So uh, I, on the good side, I'm not getting arrested. But on the bad side, I'm not having as great a time as I could. Chris, you know where you can go? Social distancing. You're still allowed to go outside for a walk. Okay, which is which is what I did today. So uh, I got up and the first thing I did is I looked at my phone and I found out that Governor DeWine extended the stay at a home order through May 29th. And I went, oh my God, uh, I'm gonna take another month of this. 
I um, know, I know. Uh, so I, I went for a, a walk and everything was going fine uh, uh, until I, I ran across this lady who had her dog out in the front yard who was peeing and the dog got really excited to see me and, and she yeah. said, oh, forgive me, it's just, it's a really social dog uh, and, uh, and he just wants to tell you he loves you and I was like, oh, and I could tell that the lady was like, don't get close enough to me to pet my dog because normally I'd be all over that. Right, understood, understood. So, you know, I waved the dog and I said, hi puppy, how are you? And then I walked away and the dog is struggling the whole time. Uh, to try to get to me, and, and as I'm walking away, I hear this very sad, Meow! and I thought, I feel the exact same way, dog. I understand. So what I was thinking is, I don't know, maybe I could start like a doggy daycare for my apartment, just so I could like spend time with dogs and, and be social, but then that like- That would be fantastic. But Not no, only can you do the dogs from your neighborhood. Everybody's at home. This is the stupidest idea. This is what my brain is doing right now. It, it, it's just, I, I, I'm, I'm completely loopy, but, but honestly, I've always gotten along better with animals than I have with people, so why not? Tracy, I, I feel you. It's hard to be cordial. Yeah. It's hard to be friendly. Yeah, it is. And Tracy. Yes. I got to tell you, I've discovered some hairs. I, I, I'm a, I, I know I'm going to regret asking this, but, but where did you discover the hairs? They're not on my head. Okay. Tracy, that Tracy there's hairs. You know, when you don't have anything to do, you take time and you look in the mirror and you take too much time and look in the mirror. I have a hair growing out of this part of my ear. Oh. No, you can't see. It. There it is. Oh. I have a hair growing up here. <laughs> I had so much ear hair. I didn't realize I had. Um, it's, it's like a forest in there. Sure, you I, can feel that that's a common thing that happens to men as they get older. I, I, I'm not sure if there's a little blue pill that you can take for that, but it might be worth looking into. Are, are you are you calling me old? Um. Uh, <laughs> uh, no. Oh. Oh God. Oh God. Okay. Um. All right, uh, you are as, as youthful a spirit as I have ever met. Uh, you know what, age is just a number. Uh, and um, hey. Yeah, throw some cliches at me, go ahead. Oh. Go ahead throw some cliches at me. Oh. I got hairs growing out of my ears. Oh, the nose God. hairs I've known about for years. But, but this, is, this is terrible. I, I can't, <laughs> oh, Tracy. <laughs> March. Mark, you know, you feel me, right? Mark. <laughs> you think you got problems. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta bake a cake for my kid's birthday. What? Okay. Everybody's talking about, oh, well, you're all, you're all cooped up. Why don't you learn how to bake? Bacon's the next new thing. Yeah, everybody's baking stuff. It's great <laughs> if you know how to bake. <laughs> I... I I could come I, and show you, but I'm not allowed to come and show you, Mark. <laughs> Dude, the freaking, the cake mixer scares the shit out of me. I don't even know what, the, I didn't even want to touch that thing. It's going to eat my hand. Don't do yeah. it. No, don't do it. No, 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 no. I can't even. <laughs> Wooden spoons. Wooden spoons? Mark! Oh, I just beat myself with a wooden spoon? Pete! Pete! <laughs> oh, you Don't look like you've been man. baking too. You've been baking, I can tell. Oh, I'm baked, man. <laughs> I'm really baked. I, we gotta get out, man. Come on, I can't take. I don't care about this quarantine. Let's go like the old days. Let's go down and hit some, some music and do some dancing, man. Music, man. We'll just bake whatever we want to bake. Just it doesn't have to be a cake. Just, just <laughs> anything else. I got a bag of stuff we can bake, man. Let's oh just, yeah! Your yeah, just a bag of like, just anything in that bag. Just pull it out. Just start. Just yeah, light it on oh, fire. Oh yeah! Oh, I got some great stuff. Jamaican hash, dude. Yeah. Hey, what? Jamaican hash. Hash. All right. If you want something that better, I got some other stuff. What? I, I love that. I was thinking something along the lines of, 
I don't know, some broccoli, like a broccoli fire or something like that. Broccoli. That sounds so easy, doesn't it? Is that, is that good? Well, if it's know, nutritious, I don't know. it's good for you. It's calcium. I heard the florets are good for you. For the mosh pit. I'm telling you, let's go out, man. Let's, let's get in the street and create like one of these dis social distance mosh pits, man. Yeah. You know, you could just circle each feet. other at exactly six feet. Just circle each other just constantly. Yeah. We'll just pretend we're lifting somebody. You know, Pete, I don't want to brag, but yeah. I went out today. <gasps> Where'd you go? Well, I went to the drugstore. <gasps> St. John's Ward? No, better. Prescription? And acids. Oh. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, I got I got an acids. You know what else I got? Me on, Marianne. You know what else I got, Pete? Are you ready for That's that? That's turning me on, girl. <laughs> I got oh, Zyrtec. <laughs> and a histamines, Pete. That's two antis. You, you crush that you crush up the pill and you said just... And the oh, next thing you know. Oh. You're you not sneezing you just anymore. Dance, well, yep, no sneezing. Just no, no, no. Yeah. This is awesome. Do you, yeah. Do you, do you get yeah. a lot? A lot. Yeah, I do a lot of antihistamines. I do. <laughs> I take like at least three different kinds. Hello, Marianne. How are hey, you? Hey, Rollin. How I are am, you? I'm feeling good, Rollin. How? Oh, that's good. How are you? Nice to see you. What's, so, what's that? I heard you had some special stuff. Oh, yeah. I got a big problem. What's that, Rollin? <sighs> the halitosis thing. Oh, uh, sure. Sure. You got anything for that? I have. Are you ready for this? I don't know. It's going to blow your mind. Are you ready? Yeah. I have mouthwash. And... Are you ready? I don't know if you can handle this part, Rollin. I have Altoids. God, yes! <laughs> What's your address? You know where I live, Rollin. Oh, I know, I know where you live. live. I know where but you I live. But I would. I would meet you at the drugstore. I, I, I don't want to flaunt it, but I know where several drugstores are. Oh, I, I thought I was going to meet you in the back of it between the drugstore and the church again. If you like. Because those sugar and cops are nosy. Yeah, I know. They are. Especially when it comes to the, the A thing. The A, yeah, the antis. They don't like the, the antis. The, the toids. Yeah. Oh, the altoids. Oh, yeah. They are very yeah, strong, Rollin. They are very strong. You have to, you have, to have a prescription. Those are toys. Rollin. Yeah. I heard you have a problem with halitosis. Yes, I do. I have been practicing, and I have become the most powerful witch. I, this, in this like last five minutes, I have done so many crazy things. I even turned the universe inside out for like 20 seconds. We're gonna get rid of that, your halitosis. Is that what that bump was? We're gonna get rid of your halitosis. Okay, how, 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 what you got? Are what you ready got? to get rid of your halitosis? Oh God, I can smell it from here, no! No, no, stop, stop, just stop it, just stop. Stop, okay? I'm trying to do magic. I thought you put something on my tongue or something. No, no, I'm, like I can't touch. No, I'm, we're, I'm on the other side of the freaking universe right now. Okay, oh. so just, let's, let's do magic, okay? Here we go. Okay, okay, all right. Okay, okay, here we go. All yeah. right, Rowan, are you ready? Yeah. Repeat after me. Okay. Garlic, Gar onions, sardines. Garlic. Sardines. Yawn. Yawn. I will give a great big yawn. <laughs> if you die from my breath. If you die from my breath. I'll know the magic I'll has been know the, the best. Been the best. Okay, now do this. You're still alive. It's gone. But it's gone. Captain RSVP, everybody. Woo! Woo! Hey! 
Oh man! Hey. That was, that was, uh, that was, a, that was a, quite a character display. Uh, everyone at home, give a round of applause for RSVP. Yay, RSVP. Hey. Oh, what fun! These lovely people are from Cleveland or nearby in Chagrin Falls, I believe, in real real time. Yeah, Chagrin. Uh, and uh, doing really great work in Northern Ohio. We love them. We're so glad they came. Even though it's virtually, it's so fun to have you. Thank you so much for being here.